tail of the tape for this world championship heavyweight bout between Lennox Lewis and Mike Tyson. Introducing the one and only Iron Mike Tyson. Undisputed heavyweight champion of the world, Lennox. Slightly dazed by one of those uppercuts. Mayhem. And Tyson. And he's the aggressor of the two. Lewis down low. And he cottoned 6'5, 250 pounds. We are ready. Then go to that body, go hard. Then make a man. Dives into it. You better fight Tyson. You better fight him. You better fight him. You give him all the courage that he needs. But that's what Lewis. Tyson, Tyson to stop moving his head now. Tyson right now trying to figure out a way to get in close. Don't let him fight the fight that he's trying to make it fight. Take your time, get the work with your jab. If you hit him with the right hands, and I'm that's not what you want to see. Tyson away also for the second time in this round. And delivers. Get that right hand down there low and make it sound. He's coming on top. He showed Tyson a lot of tapes of himself back in the 80s. This starts working on the back when a guy keeps leaning on you. Oh! Lewis unloads with another right uppercut. Tyson still trying to figure out a way to get in. Ronnie Shields told Tyson to make it an ugly fight. Emmanuel Stewart has given Lewis the permission to keep holding him. Music by Tyson. Tyson comes up with his footwork and his speed used to be such that that Lewis has had, had his way. He has taken some solid shots so far. This could cause some problem with the referee, and I'm telling you. Lewis got hurt that time. But it's Lewis. Make this a, a very ugly fight now, okay? He's slowing down real bad. Disaster. Well, Tyson is real low. You got to put your hands down where your man is. Out of uh, instructions. Lewis with a big right uppercut. That's the danger of fighting the taller guy. He's allowing Lennox Lewis to just move around the ring and do whatever he wants. With uppercuts. He's done an excellent job of Lennox Lewis Lewis pushed Tyson away that time. That's what you got to do. Push him away. That he could easily get inside bigger guy. Now Tyson able to get in a left jab. There's a left hook. And, there, and, and, and there's a cut on the right eye of Tyson. Just keep your head moving and wait. Now the jabbing him now and being cautious. Tyson is desperate. That's a good body shot by Mike Tyson. We get close, make it raggedy. You got a man hurt, he's waiting to go, finish him out. Lewis following the Holyfield blueprint. Natural instincts. And we see less bobbing and weaving. Stopped anything. Throwing. 39 punches connecting on Fred. I just looked over at Eddie Cotton, and he signaled to me that the cut was caused by a punch. Pushing Tyson back, leaning on Tyson. Lennox Lewis has been holding too much. George, he's also been punching the crap out of him. And less jabbing from Tyson and Lewis. 27 for 69 percent as he pushes them away. A lot of people were concerned about some political they thought Mike Tyson did a nice job getting inside, but... And right now, firing that 
right cross. When you are beaten, that's enough to bring you back in the picture. He is a dangerous puncher. Lewis leads on Tyson, connects with a right hand. Tyson goes down, but Eddie Cotton says no knockdown. Looked like a clear knockdown. Seems to be fighting Tyson and the referee. What he throws, that number, he's very dangerous. Just like you saw right there, Lennox stood on the outside, used that jab, and came up with some. Hands up, champ! Hands up! Tyson. You know, Lennox Lewis told us that no matter what, Ronnie's Tyson is just hoping for one. Tyson just can't find the distance. He blocked that left. At this point in the fight, the bad boy of boxing is Shields against. Spent eight weeks teaching Mike Tyson. And slow Tyson is. One good he, shot. One good shot. Emmanuel Stewart told Lennox looking for opportunities to set up his right. Now Tyson jabbed right back. He had him and jabbing him and pecking him. He should go on and lower him. Spanked by Lennox Lewis. But he is always dangerous. Oh, too much. Put the right hand on the man. Tyson in Maui during his training camp. Get out, get out, get out. the jab here and he's not trying to win points. He's just looking. Now you go leaning on his head. His head. Stop playing around with the jab. Just 19 rounds of boxing for Mike. But Lewis took it. Oh, and he brought something back. He's not dropping his head at all. Keeping his head up. Worn out. He is. And oh, five. He is. Still there waiting. Still there waiting. For Mike Tyson in his six previous fights over the last. Now, at will, in the fifth round, 31 of 50 for 62%. Tyson. Now, Tyson should take a round off now. Let this guy move into him a little bit. Five years. Frank, Tyson showing he definitely had clearly the aggressor inside the ring. He can't take too many more of those right hands. Lewis keeps that up. That fight is gone. Lewis! Not like that. Lewis again landing. You keep working the jab, but you got to add to it. You, you every time you get your hesitate, oh, no. you start to throw the shot, then you hesitate. Let the stop go. Mike, no. you go out, you're fine. No, I need your hands moving. Imploring his fighter to take care of business, right, echoing go, go, go. the sentiments of Jordan. The lack of stamina. Like Tyson slows down. Don't charge him. Just slow down. Keep your head moving. To exert force on Tyson. Mike Tyson has ever taken. It's batting practice for Lennox Lewis now. That right hand fights for all day, Fred. All I gave was to, to Mike Tyson was round one. All you have to know is that so far, it's all Lewis. One fast ball after another. Better do something. Remember, Tyson has not been able to land one straight right hand yet. Good 12 Tyson. years ago, I'm thinking now, as they watch him absorb this punishment almost without any return. You have two hands, you understand? Just let your hands go. Yes, you can. No. George, you call it batting practice. That's what it is. And this is the time maybe your corner should come in and rescue you. Keep him on the stool. Batting practice numbers that Barry Bonds would be impressed with. Oh, big good right shot. hand by Mike Tyson. Right hand on top. And just four punches, throwing only 17. Tyson told him he needs a knockout to win. I believe, George, you're right. He might have been doing looking. anything to him, so he'll do something to you. That's another good right hand. Mike Tyson's stock is falling faster than he, he seems versus a useless.
pass the seventh round. Lennox Lewis, triple Mike Tyson with a big uppercut, and Eddie Cotton separates the fighter. Five, He's called it a seven, knockdown, seven, thinking eight, that Tyson's eight, knee to to touched the canvas. Hoping that this fight oh, he's doing a good job. He's got heart. Like, he's you can't take that from him. Big right hand from Lewis, and Tyson goes down for the third time in his career. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. It's over. Lennox Lewis cements his legacy as one of the best heavyweight champions of this era. Nobody should be able, there's no one in the world can take that from Lennox Lewis now. He is no doubt the best heavyweight of all time. There's no doubt about it. The winner by knockout victory, heavyweight champion of the world, the pride of Great Britain, Lennox Lewis. I would say Mike Tyson matured at 19. He was uh, nothing was standing in his way at that time. He ruled. He ruled the planet at that time.